Hey guys, welcome back. Today's video is a follow-up to the last one I did about transferring a full ROM set over to your Nest Mini. And what we're gonna do today is go in and look at some things that transferred over that we maybe don't want, light gun games, box art that's incorrect. And I'll go ahead and show you what happens if we try to add a game that uh, maybe isn't supported by the mappers that are on the device. All right, so one of the things I know that is a mistake on here is the Kung Fu game. I wanna go in and take a look at that. So I got two Kung Fu boxes. Obviously these aren't correct. One of them is Clash Ball. For some reason, the box art for Kung Fu came over and we wanna fix that. That's one thing we're gonna clean up. All right, the next thing we're gonna look for is a light gun game. And there's Gotcha. There's probably some other ones on here too. Like I said, I transferred the full ROM set over. So we'll go ahead and remove those and I'll show you how to do that. Another game we're going to want to get rid of is Duck Hunt. And there you can see that's on here. So that's gotta go. I also had a problem with a game called Space Shuttle Project. I actually had that as a kid. I booted it up just to take a peek at it. And you'll see the, the title screen is really messed up a little bit. Yeah, see that's not right. So what we'll do is we'll download another ROM of this and, and see if that fixes the problem. It might not. Shooting Range is another game that's on here that we really don't have any need for. And that's right there. We'll go ahead and just get rid of that as well. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and open up Hakchi. And it's really simple. You see the list of all my games that'll be transferred over to the device on the left-hand side. I'm just gonna scroll down to the titles we talked about. So, there's Duck Hunt. We're gonna uncheck that. We don't need it. There's Gotcha. We don't need that. And Shooting Range. And then if you remember, when we were looking at Clash Ball, it had the box art for Kung Fu. So we're gonna go ahead and get rid of that too. So there's the Kung Fu box with Clash Ball. So I'm gonna go down here to where it says Google. I see I'm getting all the Kung Fu boxes coming up for Clash Ball, which is interesting. There's Clash Ball. Not a super high res file, but it's okay. It'll meet our needs. Okay, so the last thing I'm going to do for you guys is go ahead and try to add a game that I know just doesn't work. And we'll go ahead and pick the Famicom version of Star Wars. Okay, so I select that, open. It's going to tell me, uh, yeah, mapper number 19 doesn't work. So it's unfortunate, but at least you get a heads up before you transfer games over and waste space on things that won't work with the device. So now I've got all this cleared up, I'm gonna go ahead and transfer it over and I'll show you how to do that next. All right, so the last thing we're gonna do is go ahead and make this happen. Transfer all the files we just changed over to the Nest Mini. All right, so I'm just gonna quick verify everything looks good the way I set it up. 
Duck hunt should still be unchecked. It is. Um, we'll look at Clash Ball real quick. Clash Ball has the correct box art. And you have to trust me that I replaced the Space Shuttle ROM. So what we're going to do next is go ahead and click Synchronize the games with the Nest Mini. Okay. Important thing here really is just to hold in the reset button. Press power. Still holding reset. And we're off and running. So what you're gonna see happen is it's going to pause a few times or, or actually stop and we're gonna to have to initiate the process again. There's just so many ROMs that it's trying to transfer over that it can't do it all in one fell swoop. So it's gonna be several times, um, I don't know, maybe four or five in order to transfer 700 plus games over. We're actually losing games this time because I took off shooting range and duck hunt but i really just want you guys to see the process we'll boot the nest mini up after this is done take a look make sure those games are gone and uh, that the box art is cleaned up for clash ball okay we come to a stopping point too many roms we have to reboot so again just real simple follow the instructions it's not hard but don't brick your device doing something silly don't make a silly mistake Click OK. Okay, the power light's off on the Nest Mini, so I can go ahead and push it, the power button back out. Hold reset. Press power again. And we're back running. Probably go ahead and stop the video here. This process is going to be pretty repetitive. We're going to do that a few more times and then we'll take a look at our final product. Okay, and we're done. Okay, and we're going to wait for the power to go out. And it's done. Let's go ahead and check our work. All right, we're going to jump in and hopefully all is right with the world. Shouldn't see Duck Hunt in here. And we don't, so that's good. We'll go back to the main set of folders. Let's check on Clash Ball. There we got our box arts now correct for Clash Ball. All right, let's check on our last one, Space Shuttle Project. All right, can we go three for three here? Well, you can't have everything, can you? That's all right, I'm, I'm not all broken hearted over Space Shuttle Project. But we did get the games off of here that we didn't want. Um, the light gun games are gone. And we did get the box art fixed for Clash Ball, so. Just a quick update. I always said I'd never be that guy, but go ahead and like the video and feel free to check out some of the other Joe and Joe videos, which are more of a podcast paired with a Let's Play. Hope you like them and I'll see you next time.